For so long, we've heard about the man, but Robin has kept him from us. A lot of us wondered behind her back if he even existed, but he does, and he is here today. The man who lights the bomb in Baumgarten, <laughs> the man who puts the jam in her jelly roll, the one, the only, Mr. X. It's great to be here. Let me ask you, everybody wants to know, what is it like being Robin Baumgarten's lover? Uh, she hates that word, by the way. Yeah, I know she doesn't like that word. Does she like to use a lot of words from her era, like squire, or gentleman <laughs> caller, or beau? What does she refer to you as? Honey. Honey? Sweetheart. Oh, ho, ho. babe. Is that her pet name for you? She, call uh, it, she calls you sweetheart? Babe. Babe? Honey. Huh. What exactly drew you to her? Was it her myriad of impressions, her angelic singing voice, her encyclopedic knowledge of murder documentaries? Um, we can be honest here, right? This is a, this is a safe space. <laughs> Prior to meeting her, they watched WGM. Oh, wow. Now I watch GN religiously every day, so it wasn't that. It was how sweet she was, how nice she was, her charm. Huh. <laughs> Time together is so important. How do you make time to spend together given Robin's grueling work schedule? She puts in a lot of hours. She uh, what's out of here by 10.30, mm -hmm. goes home, takes a nap. God, I've been telling her for years, you work too hard. Yeah. All right, I gotta know this. Over the summer, uh, you got Robin to ride a jet ski. Tell me about Robin on a jet ski and spare no detail. She was scared to death, um, grabbing on. <laughs> we would go 25 to 30 miles an hour. Be careful, be careful, you're going too fast, you're too close to the boat, you're too close to the boat. So she was scared to death riding a jet ski. What's the next thrill-seeking frontier? Maybe some skydiving? Maybe... How about a safari? Oh! I want to go on a safari. Well, a friend of mine just got back, so we were looking at pictures, and doesn't it look fun? She don't want to go. She doesn't want to go to... Kill you dead. <laughs> kill you dead. Hippos will kill you dead. Kill you dead. They will kill you dead. <laughs> and she kept saying, kill you dead, kill you dead, kill you dead. They will kill you dead. She's she kind of set in her waist. Yeah. You know, and she doesn't want to experience a lot of new things, I don't think. You know, I think you can wear her down. I don't think so. You don't think so? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think don't so think either. I'll, I don't think I'll win that battle, no. Are you aware of her family's lineage and the fact that they are tile royalty? I've heard. I've, I've talked to, to Gare. You've talked to King Gare? I've talked Gare. to Gare. Had to meet. Yeah. Had to get the okay. Did you have to pay him a dowry to date Robin? <laughs> <laughs> but it, it was good. They treated me great. Yeah. I think the changes have been revolutionary, Mr. X. And what a difference you have made. And I, I think I speak on behalf of everybody who works here at WGN when I say to you, uh, stop. Uh, <laughs> happy Robin is not, we need angry, miserable Robin, okay? Uh, I've heard that from many people. Well, Mr. Rex, thank you for your time. It was nice to hear about another side of Robin. And, you know, I feel like I owe you a little something. A little gesture from me to you. I'd like to take you someplace. What do you say? Let's go. Let's go? Let's go. All right. Oh, I can't watch this. <laughs> This is the life, Ugh. huh? Doesn't suck. Has anybody ever told you you have great feet? Let me get a look at those again. Oh, oh. Just feet. Somebody ought to tell you how nice no, those are. Nobody's ever said that before. How about mine? Nice. Beautiful. <laughs> tell you, Mr. Rex, Doesn't I could stay suck. here all day. Doesn't suck. Oh. Oh. <laughs>